debate as an art form, what do you like about it? To me, debate as an art form is kind of an understatement. For me, debate is life. And if you realize, when you go to debate tournaments, there are two types of debaters. Those who are in it to win, and those who are in it like they're actually people arguing for it. Debate is an art form in a way because the way we speak, the way we make our arguments so fast, so quick, and so eloquent, not most people can do. The way we act is pretty amazing because we do things that most adults wouldn't be able to do. In some cases, we act better than some politicians do. Very true. So what do you, how do you think it's going to help you down the road? Down the road? Well, when I started off debate, I was pretty much a quiet person, a uh, non-open person. After two years of debating, I'm pretty much a good thinker. I express my ideas a lot more. I'm more able to clearly communicate within a group. And I am more able to take leadership of certain roles. Um, what do your mentors or your coaches, what do they, what do they try to impl or impact you? Or how do, you, how do they try to, uh, what do they tell you to inspire you, to influence you, you think? Well, our coaches um, have become more than coaches for most of us. Our coaches have become most, mostly our counselors. They help us not only in debate and in debating, but also in life. To motivate us, our coaches pretty much, they tell us that we can be big things, that we can do big things. Because when we debate, we're on top of the world. And they kind of do tell us that if we keep up the way we are, we are going to be at the top of the world forever. So we'll go into that a little more. What do you mean by that? I'm top of the world because you, you are explaining your point so, so crucially to, 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 to a point that there's no... It's the best understanding of that point. What, tell me why it's so great. When you're debating, there comes a point where you feel like you're actually making the change. You feel like you're on top of like the Senate or Congress actually talking. You actually feel like you're Obama or something. And when you come down, you come down all high-headed, all happy, and you act like you made a change. But after a while, you start to realize it's still just debate. But our coaches tell us that one day, if we do keep trying, then we can be one of those people who make decisions like that, that we can be politicians and lawyers like we all want to be. Very cool. Um, so lastly, what, um, when you look back five, ten years from now, what do you think you're going to remember most about? The friends I've made. The people at Men Debate are probably the best people I've ever met in my life. They're friends that I will never find again. They're people so sophisticated, so helpful, so nice that it's unmatchable. Everyone that I meet is always one of my best friends here. Very cool. Do you have like a, uh, a proud moment you can point to that maybe you could just give me a quick scenario of what happened that it came from your experience so far? There are some debates where we come short, shortly prepared for the round. So it's kind of a moment where we have to think on our feet. And I remember being in a round where it was finals, everybody was watching, my team was unprepared, and I remember getting up and just saying what I felt. I didn't use any debate cards, I didn't use any evidence. It wasn't strategically the best move, but I hit the moral arguments, and I still managed to topple their arguments without any paper. It was just something I made up on my mind, but was still pretty useful. So what does that tell you? I mean, you can, so you can think on your thing, think on your feet, but what does that tell you kind of about you, yourself? It tells me that I can think faster than most people. I can think, when I think, I'm an open-minded thinker. I think of not what happens in the short term, I think what happens long term. I think about the people around me and what might the consequences of my actions do. Okay. Very good. I think you'll...